Banshee mode for everything boarding. These maneuvers could be dangerous if not operating the boat properly. Do so at your own risk. Make sure to always have boarding safety equipment, pleasure craft license on board, and always wear your PFD. Be conscious of those around you. Respect the shared water weight. Remember, never drink alcohol on boat. Always place safe on the water. Today, we're taking a look at outboard hydrofoils. This specific hydrofoil is a Stingray Classic Senior. It's designed for pretty well all outboard boating applications and is a great asset to have on your engine to increase the performance of your boat. It provides a moderate lift, but it also provides a high speed. It utilizes an easy four bolt system and it installs with ease. You always wanna get the most out of your engine power wise, fuel economy, and performance. And this Stingray Classic Senior is gonna help you do that. A hydrofoil can reduce or eliminate cavitation. The hydrofoil works to reduce cavitation by effectively making the water pressure around the propeller higher, thus getting the propeller more water. Think of your hydrofoil as sort of like a wing. It goes past the water in the same way an airplane's wing goes past the air. So if you're gonna trim your boat back, the water is gonna hit underneath your hydrofoil. It's gonna help your boat actually lift up and get into that hydrodynamic state better and get your boat on plane quicker. And this baby is gonna do the trick. Now let's take off to boat school and we can take a closer look on how hydrofoils work. Welcome to boater school. The hydrodynamic lift is using a small section of the boat the smaller the area getting wet underneath the boat and the faster you go. So with your hydrofoil, you're gonna trim up and that hydrofoil is specifically designed to channel that water in a path just like an airplane wing with the ailerons for the lift. It's specifically designed to help lift your boat up, get on plane easier, get that hydrodynamic lift and really get the most out of your boat. Any outboard motor can easily be fitted with a hydrofoil. It has proven performance. A hydrofoil just makes it so much easier to get on plane. probably wondering what's this picture on the wall well this is a portrait my beautiful wife painted of a young lady that's looking out the window because she's missing her boat and she's looking at the lake and she's thinking I wish I was boating back to boating Woo! you know what just ripping wow that's fantastic you know what I just can't wait to get boating again how do you know how do you know you're at the right level of trim? So basically, when you're driving your boat, you ease on the throttle. The throttle basically controls it just like the car gas pedal. You can fly it. All right. So here we got our trim. depending on the waves in your surroundings. So it takes practice learning how the boat reacts to the surrounding water. And uh, depending on the size of the boat, every boat has different characteristics. The Banshee boat, for instance, it gets on plane fairly quickly. With the hydrofoil, it makes it so easy, especially when the water is fairly level, uh, to get on plane. And we can actually hit some big waves riding right on top of the water. Bring your boat right to the planing. You can plane right up, and then you start cruising through the water like that. Bring the front end of your boat, get the hydrodynamic lift going, and once that's going, you can really cruise through the water. When we're doing the bunny hops here, I'm pressing the throttle down, bring the front end up. When I'm doing that, you're also keeping the engine at, a, at enough speed, at enough RPM, so it can hit that brake loose power, it can hit that mid RPM power band when you're bringing the front end up.
Coming up on the next video, join us as we take you for a fantastic tour through Lake Minnewanka. Nestled between the mountains just northeast of Banff National Park, located in Alberta, Canada, Lake Minnewanka is home to many different types of wildlife, including grizzly bears, mountain goats, and bald eagles. Did I mention the ancient spirits and the sunken abandoned town? Come with us as we experience the beautiful mountain views, the pristine glacier-fed waters, as well as the rich history and all the mystery Lake Minnewanka has to offer. Woo! Banshee Bone, baby!